Hey guys, Jason Cipriani here, a CNET how-to contributor. Today we're going to discuss how to use the built-in dictionary app on iOS 5. This is a feature that's built into the iOS and some users may not even be aware that it's built in or that it's available. Uh, it, you really have to kind of look for it at times and other times it's right in front of you but you may not realize what it is. So what we'll do is anywhere you can highlight text or select text you're able to pull up the dictionary app. So I have a tweet pulled up here and we're going to go ahead and select the word Android and see what the built-in iOS 5 dictionary has to say uh, about Android. So we have copy, delete, which we can't delete this text, and then we have define. Tapping on define will open the dictionary app and give you its definition for the word you have highlighted. In this case, it's Android and nothing here about Google. Not a real big surprise. Android is a robot with a human appearance. Uh, it's become so much more than that, Apple. We'll go ahead and press, tap, press on Done. Not only can you highlight and get a definition for static text, text you can't edit yourself, but you can also get te or a definition for text that you're entering yourself. So I'll just enter a random word, and then we'll select it. Now you don't see Define on this screen, or on this pop-up. You'll see Cut, Copy, Paste, suggestion if you want to use a different word than technology or you could hit the over arrow and there's define go ahead and tap on that and then there's a whole bunch listed under here for technology so that's it it's pretty simple straightforward uh, it's not there or it's there if you if you know what you're looking for and if you don't know what you're looking for it's not there Make sure to come over and join us on howto.cnet.com. We have a lot more great tech tips about iOS 5, Android, anything else you can imagine. Come and join us.